Radar. It was a dreary day here across the valley. We had rain, widespread rain, with some locations picking up near an inch of rain during the day. There's still some rain showers and some snow showers falling. You can see those wet conditions as we take a live look out from the Unsound Warren Regional Airport. Temperatures today started out in those low to mid 40s, but temperatures fell throughout the day. We were in th the 30s for a majority of the day. Now we're into those low to mid 30s, 34 degrees, but with winds at about 15 miles per hour, it does feel colder across the region. Temperatures are low to mid 30s, 33 in Newton Falls, 32 in Grove City, 33 in Youngstown, 32. The current temperature in Stonebro, it's 33 in Minerva. I don't expect temperatures to move much as we head throughout the overnight hours. We'll see temperatures remain in those low 30s as we head towards tomorrow morning. Storm Team 27 Viper radar not picking up on much, but I have been looking at some of our weather cameras across the region. And even though we're not seeing it here on radar, we are still seeing some light snow showers and some mist falling throughout portions of the region and that will continue to be possible as we head throughout the overnight hours before that chance begins to taper off as we head towards tomorrow morning. The system bringing us this rain and snow has pushed off to the east coast. Behind that drier air starting to work in, we're going to have high pressure build in and that's going to bring us a drier a start to the work week, though the beginning of the work week still going to be cloudy and it is going to be cooler here across the region. For tonight, cloudy skies. Again, still that potential for some mist and some light snow showers. That chance going to taper off as we head towards tomorrow morning. For your Monday, as you head out the door, cloudy skies, very small chance of a flurry or a light snow shower early. We'll see cloudy skies for the remainder of the day with temperatures climbing into the middle to upper 30s for afternoon highs. So a colder day is expected, but a mainly dry day is expected. It's going to stay dry Monday night, cloudy skies with temperatures falling to near 30 degrees. Tuesday, our next system is going to roll it. Tuesday is going to start out dry, cloudy skies, a few breaks in the clouds possible. But once we get towards Tuesday afternoon, our next system is going to start to push in. That's going to bring us that chance for rain and snow showers. And I do expect that chance to increase once we head into Tuesday night. Now that chance will start to come to an end as we head into Wednesday morning. Temperatures Tuesday going to be warmer than Monday. We'll see high temperatures in the upper 30s and low 40s. For tonight, 31, still some rain and snow showers around. Winds going to be breezy at times, near 15 miles per hour at times throughout the night. 36 tomorrow, mainly cloudy, slight chance of a flurry early. And then once we get past tomorrow, we have that chance for rain and snow Tuesday. Another disturbance Thursday night into Friday. The next weekend looking dry but cooler. Temperatures throughout the week, 30s and 40s.